Yes. <laughs> Does everybody have their hand off? Everybody. <laughs> Everyone got one or got access to one? A guy with a partner? Good. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. Here he is, folks. The prophet. Fire. The profiteer. The drinker of tears. He's beaten the charges. He's beaten the paternity suit. He beat the clock. And then he beat off. The one. The only. The great Chardesky! <laughs> I think I've, I got cancer now. <laughs> Crying. <laughs> That's, That's not even a beer. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. If you've heard Peter Huff, then you know the great Chernesky's here tonight. Yeah. All the way from Auburn to Rochester and back. Shows in that gypsy road. Here we go. Macking the knife out there. <laughs> Secondly, <laughs> Macking a fucking cobra knife. So, I'm not gonna point fingers tonight, but someone's fucking smoking out there. Oh, you guys have uh, fireworks? Yeah, there's smoke in here, man. And I'm interrogating everyone so they can. <laughs> you find out what's up. I will, but until I'm gonna fucking use some nasal spray. Oh, I got my fucking eye. <laughs> I toured with Marco Polio before. He turned me on to over the 
over-the-counter medications to solve daily life problems. <laughs> it seems like another... It seems like there needs to be another hymnal out there. Does anybody need one of these? I don't think Andrew has one. Andrew, that's so you can sing along. <laughs> and I want to hear your beautiful voices like the angel choir out here tonight. I want to turn to number two, hymn number two in their booklet. Anyhow, this one's called Apologies. We don't make none. <laughs> Centuries to make amends, to make amends. Oh, when you get to the bottom, you're all the same. We pump them off and you know your name. Oh, when you get down on a stiff drink, nobody asks for an apology. Oh, I don't need no apologies. Tennessee Street. Daddy had money, mom was a pretty thing. I traded off weekends banging her friends. Took five years to make amends. To make amends. Sean hit the low note. Hit the low note with him. Ready? Oh. To make amends. And when you get to the bottom, you're all the same. When you come to that, you know your name. Or when you're stepping out on your best day, nobody asks for an apology. Well, I don't need no apologies. Well, I don't need no apologies. I don't need no apologies. No more. Hey, Dr. Solo! From a fresh grave. You know, it was reverend. It took the Lord's help to make amends. To make amends. And when you get to the bottom, you're all the same. When you pump them up, It's time to sell some shit. Right? Let's, let's, get, let's get down to business, people. I've got these lovely Chinesky teas on sale at the table next to the mall. And then my good friend Sam Egan. My good friend Sam Egan has some EPs for free back there. They also cost 50 cents. They're LPs. 
no, no, no. What are they? LPs? They're long playing records. Well, no, here's the thing, though, because I have an LP for sale after the show myself, so I didn't want to confuse people oh. that there were two LPs. What kind of LP do you have? Well, I mean, in my case, uh, LP stands for long penis. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> this one's called I Won't Feel Right. Oh, I got rid of from the tremors. And I got soul, I got soul to the bottom of my dark bodies. And I won't feel alright. Till the sweat is on the sticking on these bones. I won't feel right. Till this bedroom in the street. Oh no, I won't feel alright. Oh well then. In the street. And I spent evenings with the few that the cops don't ever meet. And I won't feel alright till the good old blues part won't feel alright till I won't ask everyone. Since you gave me hell And you're beautiful And you know it too That's the best and worst I can say about you Oh, 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 oh. Now I got rid of the tremors in my hands And I got sold in my dark heart And you oh, 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 oh And the devil's in the basement And the angels in the sky And they all wishing they was here tonight Oh, oh Ripping it up now. It's a whole lot better than last night. Yeah. Yeah. Tomorrow. Girl, it seems so far away. Yeah, yeah. I got my best shoes on. Let's go dancing. We all got questions, but they don't need answering. Because tonight, 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 we're gonna. explanation there. I usually play that song in a key I call G. Uh, fuck the establishment. But I took the harmonica part out today um, and I decided that I would impress you all with my musical prowess and that I would change it to G sharp. Well the problem is when the chorus comes I'm now playing <laughs> the wrong minor chord. I think that's what they're called. 
So, I, 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 long lesson short, I shouldn't have fucked with the song. I told you. <laughs> well, if you told me everything, I would have, you know. That's not good. Well, okay. So, it's come to my attention that it's fucking smoky in here. Yes. And I haven't you found. Think? Whatever, fuck it, you weedhead bohemians. <laughs> Smoked it up. Oh, God damn it. Oh, I get to enjoy it. It's That's really how it goes. There's no smoking in the attic. True Colors show. Oh, it's been two years now. You the chameleon can't hide forever. I smoked you out. Not like you like it. I'm just going to do some eye drops. Forget about it. Yeah, they are. You want some? You got a job interview tomorrow? Hell no. Anybody need some? Graham, you need some? You need some, man? Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I'm gonna trip home. Yeah, Chineski. <coughs> yeah, now I feel alright. <laughs> now I got three in the hymnal. <laughs> that was three in the hymnal. Cause I, you weren't looking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're like that person who goes to a football game and doesn't clap. I clapped anyway. At the football I'm, game? I'm insulted. All right, I well, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no. Here's a diary entry. Uh, ha anybody seen the Great Chernesky before? Uh, I have. Wow. Then you know that I read a diary. I keep a diary. But I don't keep my own diary because I don't believe in it. I think it's sissy. <laughs> So I write a diary every night where I write about a guy who's about, he just turned 40, and he, leaves, he lives on the lower crust of life. He, uh, he don't have a very good job. He works at the Applebee's as a waiter. His uh, wife had a child that uh, racially he figured out quickly was not his. And uh, he just kind of, he's an interesting guy. Hygiene's not a to-do. This is a, a man who lives a, a sordid life, and I just like to write as him each night. So, uh, here's what it goes. Dear Diary, I don't need anyone telling me I'm pre-diabetic, especially some asshole at the fair. Now, Calvin, my not-son, he can be pre-diabetic. That's fine. He doesn't have a job. All he does is play his racing games and cock-block me. So that wasn't too hard to hear. But me, I'm a hard-working man. I may enjoy a nacho lunch four or five times a week. And it's only natural to wash it down with a tall glass of wine mixed with woodchuck cider. But where does this nerd get off screening me for diabetes? We were obviously in the children's health tent for the boy. In lieu of having a doctor, we might as well capitalize on free health advice at the fair. Especially since God knows what genes he's got in him. I'm grown, I'm a grown man, however, and don't need to hear that. That bit of honey is not a breakfast food. <laughs> People forget that I was going to be a doctor. I even took biology 101 at the Cortland State. I understand that it is normal for a man my age to constantly be sweating and to black out from time to time. This uneducated clown, this Mr. Mark Henderson, M.D., don't know squat. Probably, he is, well, but probably right about Calvin. And uh, the long and the short of it is that I've been called pre a lot of things in my life, but I won't stand for pre-diabetic. Thank you. What is this? I took a stand there. As a fictional man. You poured it on me. You poured it on me. Art and government. Yeah, you're gonna need this is him four in the missile. <laughs>
in your missalette. I believe it's number five. This song is about me. It's about, kind of about the time I got health insurance. Which made this all possible. You can drink all the beers you want, take all the pills you want, but there's a lesson to be learned. That you always need insulin shots. No matter how old you are, no matter if you have diabetes or not. So I, I like to shoot myself up a couple times a day, just to, uh, to, uh, so I, can, I found I can, uh, get, uh, I can drink more. <laughs> I can use that later. <laughs> oh, they give them to you, you get the health insurance. I think they pass that for all of you now, which is going to slow my ride a bit at first. Until you're 29. Until I, until I assume the identities of some dead people as well. <laughs> Who are heavily medicated. <laughs> Where does this one go? I think my eyes. All right, this one is a song we should all sing extra loud. This one's about me. Call to us to rise again. Oh, fucking man, the hype man is here. Want me to hype you up? You beat it. Well, they say it takes a city to raise a child. Well, it's all over New York now. It's fun. Some of them tears. My brother's a pastor, plays at the church, with no stone to hang 
It's really ironic because I heard Pat Benatar on the bus to Potsdam this morning. Yeah? Yeah, and you just mentioned Pat Benatar, and I was like, no way, really? And yeah, it was actually that song you were playing, Love is a Battlefield. I don't know. I actually I just played Chernesky Rides again. 
<laughs> well, I haven't seen you play live, so to which it's pretty, I owe no royalties. Sure. <laughs> yeah. No, it's understandable. You owe yourself a good stiff drink. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and this is a very good time to introduce Mr. Peter House. Round of applause. Come on. God gave you two hands. He's gonna play some lead guitar on this song, the last song. And I'm gonna need all of you. This has some uh, audience customer participation. <laughs> oh, what customer? I said that because you're going to buy tons of shit from the Emotron Mall. <laughs> right? Back there. That smoke did not clear out. <laughs> And you've got these beautiful Trinesky shirts. We also have some Peas to Meet You t-shirts. Both are $5 a shirt. Limit 17. We're all supposed to do a lot of things. I got around this fucking thing. How did it even happen? Twice. Peter House released a new album. He is a musician. One more time Don't let around. the guitar fool you. He is a musician. Chris, what? Chris, you want to go one more time around? Or you can do that. Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> if you hadn't had enough the last time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Peter House's new album. Do you have any here? Yeah, they're not out. I'll put them out after, uh, after you. All right, you can get the Peter House album. You can buy them in lieu of any CDs I have. If you go to Chernesky.org, the info is in your hymnal. You can download all my music for free. There's three tracks. Like what? <laughs> you can get Sam Egan's EP for free. It's an LP. You can get my LP. Anywhere you want it. Hey, this one's called Old Sweet Memories. I'm going to need you people, so get ready. Drink your beers.
This song is brought to you by the E sound at the end of a name. Like a Trinesky, that E at the end is what rhymes with the song. And if you can't think of anything, if you rhyme, then you have to say it. the name of the person you last slept with. And no, sweet Emily, I'll remember thee. And no, sweet Stephanie. My hallucinations. What? <laughs> What'd you say? That guy with the handle out there. Yeah. <coughs> you screaming for an encore. <laughs> you were? Yeah, he was. I saw him. My eyes were blinded by smoke, but I saw him. Hardcore. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know this encore can't be playing because. It's not in the hymnal. <laughs> so we're off the grid here, people. What's gonna happen? I wish I could tell you. We're gonna get too intimate. Serious. We're gonna play a little song called Tears. Cause they're fucking filling my eyes. <laughs> this is what it must be like to stand for something, and then the police come. <laughs> But there's an app for that. <laughs> I'd like to thank everybody. I'd like to thank the robot that played before me. No problem. <laughs> 
shot. Yeah, friendship robot. I fucking love those horse jokes. <laughs> I'd like to thank Peter House. This one's for Brandon Murphy. This one's for Brandon Murphy. This one's for Brittany Murphy. This is for Brittany Murphy and everyone that fucks out of their league. Eddie! <laughs> On a dirt bike. This one's called Tears. Sing the song. Just because it's not in the hymnal.